girls. I can't wait for this. It's Tuesday, February 23rd, 2009, and time for Live from the Future with Stuart Pep. Tonight's guest, the Rad Girls, with John Bolton and the Boltones, Jesse Schneiderman at the Message Center, and now your host, Stuart that you've got tonight guys it is tuesday february 23rd and it's time for live from the future uh we have a packed jam-packed show we are the dirk diggler of shows wow. we have a lot of junk in our front business tonight in our front uh, a lot of show for your face hole because tonight what? we are bringing you not one not two but all three rad girls look at that is that legal, that. Yeah. Is that legal? that's right they they're gonna be in the same room. Room. there they are look, look at that, that. It's sexy. And you want a headshot? I feel like that's uh, that's that's the one where Ramona's like, guys, when are we gonna stop? I have to piss. That's that picture. <laughs> um, we have all three girls. We have uh, we have uh, some live animals. We have a show, mm. a game show at the end uh, that involves a lot of drinking and a lot of questions. Wow. And uh, we have so much show to get to, so we're gonna get right to it. But I don't do this show alone. <laughs> I wish I did at times, but I don't do this show alone. I do this with the most gorgeous musical co-host in recent memory, and I'm talking about the only co the most beautiful what? lumberjack I know, Jesse Schneiderman, oh, everybody. Switcheroo. Jesse Schneiderman. I, you know what, Jesse, your voice sounded magnanimous tonight. So well, she's on tonight. Thank you so much. You, and you know, John and I were paying attention to the message boards. We see that you want this online. Yes. And I, I do also happen to have a video of, of our our show that we did at the uh, video rental store, including a little kid perusing while we're screaming about vaginas and God. Yes. So How about we do this, you guys Jesse? Will see it soon. I have something to counter offer to all of our fans out there. What if we can get uh, I don't know, like hundred dollars in donations tonight? Then why don't you guys throw that up exclusive for the fans of Gay for God? Gay for God exclusive. You know what Gay I mean? Gay for God exclusive. I feel like We're that would be it. something we could dangle to the fans. We're fans. Dropping. Because uh, that's what we want tonight. We want your donations so that we know that you care and uh, we know that you want to see Live from the Future every damn week. Uh, this just in, we booked Brian Posehn, February uh, March 9th. That's right. He's on, celebrity Sarah on Silverman. Street. Yeah, Sarah Silverman program. Uh, of course, he's over there sounding delightful as if John Mayer himself was <laughs> raping his trachea. Uh, it is John Fulton, everybody. John! Hey, um, Stu, great to see you. You look sparkly. You look amazing. Uh, you look fantastic. Great to be here. We got a pants full show, my man. We do, indeed. It's, it's locked and loaded and ready to go. Um, we I'm have a little three, nervous. Yeah, I know. I, I'm telling you, we have three amazing guests. The Rad Girls here are here. Uh, Rad Girls, they're going to tell it. We, we actually have a DVD. Rad Girls, Rad to the Bone. If you get that one, see, it's a play on words. Not many people have a bad DVD. That's impressive. And Rad... I like that. I got this one. Here's a movie. Rad News Bears. Oh. No one ever oh. zing. No? Wow. Not, not feeling it? Oh, oh. The Rad Girls are flipping me off through the curtain. I can feel it. Oh, uh, they already left, Stu. But we it. got the Rad Boys coming up. No, that would be Rad Boys. That sounds like the worst all-male gay dance troupe. Rad Boys. Rad Boys. <laughs> what you gonna do? Uh, Rad Boys. Don't want them on the show. Rad Boys. <laughs> It, I Coming for you! I thought we were gonna try the other one, Rad, the Rad, the Adonis Summer which one. Which one? Which one was it's, that? It's Rad Girls. Because originally, Rad, Rad girls. girls. No, that that's Coming the Coming on a show. I feel like that's what? the Who, right? Yeah. That's got to be. And Daltry. that was the other one. The, it's like the Donna Summer one. Rad yeah. Girl, like uh, it has the whistle. In it. Talking about Rad Girls. There you go. Uh, talking about but Rad, that sounds like, Rad Girls. Sounds like John Denver doing it right there. <laughs> Country Rad Girls. <laughs> Uh, so all right. Rad. So here's what we're gonna do. We have, uh, we have, uh, you know what? We were gonna start off the show with hello, and I feel like, you know, we oh, did we that should. last week, and yeah, I feel yeah. like we could do it this week. Here's the thing. Everybody in this room here, as soon as John stops singing, you all just yell hello. That's how we do that one. It's true. All right, let's do it, John. Someone just called me the man. Pretty excited about that. Pretty Piston excited about Hammer. that. You're the man. Or you might be a woman. I don't know. If you're a woman, you might want to get that looked at. Let's start the Starting show off. Starting off the show with hello. 
Hello, how you doing? It's good to see you. Starting off the show with hello. Jesse. Hi, what's up? I was Star- just Starting off the show uh, with a big goddamn everybody. Hello. hello. Starting off the show with hello. Ooh, going up there. Great. We are on fire tonight, you guys. That's right. Um, would you like to win a Rad Girls DVD, Rad to the Bone? Um, you have to donate. All you have to do, you have to donate, but you also <laughs> have to follow anymore. us on Twitter. LV, our super producer, is going to be Twittering out how you can win the DVDs. We also have posters. Everything's going to be signed by the girls. Everything oh. is going to be signed by the girls. Right, girls? Don't you give me no attitude. Oh, I got a yeah, that's right. Uh, they're going to do whatever we tell them to do because for the next hour. Is that true? It's true. It's in the contract. It's in the contract. She just told me to F off. No, she told me to F off. These oh, these uh, girls, a little randy. Uh, we're going to show you a little bit really? of the rag. I don't know. I feel like Bob, Bruce Brady with that one. A little randy. Uh, how come there are no boys named Randy anymore, right? Because it's a verb. That's true. It's an adjective. What? No, it's not. It's an adjective and it's also a name. Guy on American Idol. Little oh, pitchy dog. Randy Jackson. Little pitchy. Little pitchy dog. <laughs> <laughs> All right, before we get our first guest out here, we're going to show you a little clip of Rad Girls. We have three nice. of them. We got three. We have three clips. That's we a have lot three of clips. clips. Like we it. got three clips, and we're going to kick it off with Paintball. So when Brian gives me the thumbs up. I got a song for uh, it. Oh, we have a song yeah, for this yeah. one? How are you going to lead into a clip with a song? Rad Girl Clip One. Rad Girl Clip One. Get to the clip. All right, we're going to. All right. You got her, I saw it. Like right then, I got a damn. <laughs> Did it hurt? Fuck yeah, it hurt. That was so gnarly. It broke the skin. Strong, it drew blood. Go. <laughs> Clip. All right, first up from Rad Girls, we have Ramona Cash. You can catch her Rad Girls Friday night on MAV TV. Please welcome Ramona, everybody. Ramona, Woo! welcome. Thank you, thank you. What, is, what, what was, was this a dance move? It was that like I'm a supposed half to? hustle. Oh, it was a little, I was like, nice. It was the hus. It was the hus. Um, so, Rad Girls, what is a Rad Girl? Well, what is a rad girl? A rad girl's like a girl you meet who's totally cool. Like, totally down, like, kind of daring, probably pretty immature. Okay. Yep. May, maybe willing to, like, you know, be grosser than gross. Right. You know what I mean? Like, like just the kind of chick that you're like, man, that's the kind of chick I'm talking about. You know what I mean? Were you, did you, like, light your farts growing up? And you're like, I gotta turn this into a career. I sure I did. Got I got it. In fact, we, I had, like... Our friend was like, it looked like backdraft. I did it in these very pants uh, this season. In these very, as though, yeah. these will be in the Hall of Fame. One yeah. Day. I did it in these very <laughs> these pants. These very pants. These very pants. You, um, if you feel like inclined to light a fart, be our guest. I w- thanks. This would not I've be. Really, I feel really welcome now. <laughs> Al Roker was Lay, on the show. He was lighting the farts all damn night. Awesome. Um, so you actually, uh, people wouldn't know this about you. You have uh, a degree in education, right? I do have a master's degree. A master's degree yes. in education. So you taught fourth graders. Fourth graders, third graders, sixth graders. I got oh. to teach sex ed. Ugh. No, it was awesome. I'm so a natural, liked it? apparently. What did you? T- you're like, check it out. This is how it happens. Here's a tape of me, Saturday <laughs> night, right? Don't mind. Like, how did you teach sex ed to these kids? Well, you know, the best part of teaching it was uh, the anonymous question box, mm, right? So, right. right. Oh, I remember. Remember that. the yeah. anonymous question yeah, box, right? That was awesome. So, you know, what is an orgasm? Oh. How does it feel? You know, like the awesomest We're all questions still ever. Right? You're know. like, who knows, guys? Next question. <laughs> um, an orgasm. That sounds like the worst dish at a Japanese restaurant mm, ever. Right. I would love it. Um, all right, so uh, you, uh, the Rad Girls, have been together for how many years? 
God, like five years, girls, right? Five, five years. years. And uh, yeah. you were apparently like you guys did the warp tour a little bit ago, uh -huh. and uh, something happened where all your stuff got stolen. You want to yeah, tell us that's what right. happened? Uh, it was our first night. We were in Seattle, and wait, uh, what do you do with the warp tour? You just like punch kids with lip rings in the face uh -huh. and tell them to go home. Like, hey, pick up a real record, Green Day. <laughs> Like, what do you we tell We were them? definitely like, it, we were pretty much like, wow, the average age of the kid here is pretty much 15. Like, right. average age. Like, sure. there were like tweens there, right. you know? What we did at the Warp Tour, we kind of like, uh, well, one thing that I thought was kind of sick, Clem got dressed up like she was pregnant and was like, stage diving and like crowd surfing and stuff. <laughs> that is funny. People were tripping. So, you guys were sort of like amazing. doing realistic pranks during. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, like, I, in my hometown of San Diego, cruised around with like a fake period stain on my ass mm -hmm. and uh, that definitely turned some heads among the tweens in particular mm -hmm. you know um, so we kind of just like cruised around and, and we're little mischief makers that's cool it was that totally like cool fun. but so what happened on the first night of the tour dude man Seattleites out there not uh, feeling them yeah well no no I love my sister lives in Seattle actually but too um, much heroin that's the problem <laughs> too much player hating in Seattle guys come on no anyway um, uh, we were uh, getting wine and we came back out to the car and all the windows were smashed and like all our camera gear was gone, all our sound equipment, all our computers, like makeup, makeup, which in HD is kind of no joke. Right. So, you know, it was it was not a, an auspicious beginning. It oh, was like man. our first night, but it's cool. We kind of like bounced back. We had to. We had to like sit in the car with each other and like rock it out for the next week. All See what happens when Soundgarden breaks up, you guys. <laughs> That's all you got in your damn city. You and your Why? heroin. And, um, so how do you recover from that? You just like... You, we had to. We you just borrowed, like, you're like, oh, we got to go talk to the Jim Rose side circus people. Can I borrow your cock ring? Like, what do you say? You know? we, we started wearing like band merch, you know, like right. from the bands. Yeah. I'm like, all my shit's coming. I'll wear your shirt. Right. You know? Yeah, cool. it was cool though. It was, I mean, not cool, like cool. It was cool, but, but like... cool, cool, like cool, cool. You know, the dude abides or whatever. I got it. That's yeah. cool. All right. Uh, this is our first rad girl. Uh, we're going to go over to Jesse so she can say hi to some of you chat roomies. Uh, not only are you going to get Ramona, but you're going to get Darling Clementine, and then you're also going to get Munchie at the end. And then you're going to see all three together, and there's going to be booze and beer-fueled mayhem. Uh, let's get some questions and hellos and um, hi, how are yous? And oh, it's so good to see ya from the chat room. Jesse? Uh, yeah, what's up? I want to say what's up to Demented Rants. Mm. And El Professor. Also, what's up, aliens? Digimap, Mike the Swede, Fat Lee Dama, Manko Les, Chris W, Arca Toothpaste, Sergeant Silent, Hemoglobin. What's up, you guys? I want to write to you in the chat room, but I am having a little problem figuring out what the password is. I think the people at the stream aren't comfortable with me chatting with you guys. You oh, know? my God. You're Trust being banned. Me. Um, but so if you want to talk to me, I am me until I figure out what the password is. What's up, Andrew? And What's up, Vegs? Pirate Zombie Ninja. And Penguin Jesse, Ford. here's something you can look for. Um, at the, the last game, we're gonna do a game show with all three rad girls at the end. It's called Easy, Medium, or Drunk. And mm. all the three girls are gonna need their own personal internet um, like chat room technician. So if you want to help the girls at the end of the show, uh, you gotta IM Jesse at the stream.tv. Also, uh, we want your donations, lovely viewers. We need your donations. Otherwise, John's going to be whoring himself again. I was going to write Bar. something to them. Friday I was Friday night, it's, John. If, if you has watch him, pay for it's, sex. it's the loneliest strip tease ever he does to a John Mayer impression. And I'm like, you cry yourself to da, sleep da, da, at night. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> Johnny Fulton. <laughs> what um, I really wanted to um, just quickly say, what I wanted to write in the chat room was if, if they had any um, suggestions or things that they wanted at any of us or the... Uh, the rad girls. Yes, okay. or the rad girls to do, and you'll pay us to do it. Oh, that's good. Oh, well, then, actually, I have something... Then that would be good. <laughs> then that would be great. <laughs> um, all right, well, you, uh, you listed some of your skills, Ramona. Skills. Your, some of your skills. And uh, yeah, so no. I, we prepared a little bit for you oh, called really? Useless Skills with Ramona Cash. Oh, because um, awesome. not only can you play the ukulele, yes. um, you also have double jointed thumbs, yes. but you also said you can put your whole fist in your mouth. 
Yes, that so is correct. I think that's, oh, we have a ukulele. So um, what we could do is whoever donates the most right now, they Gets could pick choose. which one Ramona is going to do. Oh, you're giving me but the time there, out. There's a time out because I, I actually just um, knocked out my front tooth last <gasps> week and got stitches. So I can't, my, oh, no. my mouth isn't really like. So you're Ready saying? Ready for extreme showing off. I don't so know. So we have to. That might be a well, disqualifying How did that story. happen? Or. I was trying to board slide this box and I just face planted instead. I tried to board slide a box once. Oh! Let me just up top. Oh, up top. top. Nice drop. Well much. done. Well very done. well done. Um, I do. Okay, we have the ukulele. <laughs> All right, fine then. If you're saying the fist in the mouth, yeah. that was going to be how I was going to go to sleep tonight. I, but, you know, okay. actually, I, I flew here today uh, from New York. I mean, I live in LA, but I, I was on a flight and I was thinking. I follow. I'm okay, I sorry. I was like, what? Like, how yeah, did she air. get what? here? Um, fly from the future. No, sorry. But anyway, so I was thinking about that and I was. I was gonna try and like see if I could still do it, and I realized oh, no. that the dude next to me was kind of like <laughs> starting to look over at me because I was like, I, I was starting to do it, and he, he already kind of hated me because I ate a like a hard boiled egg on the flight. Oh, kind of stinky. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. Making enemies everywhere. Yeah, that's you know, good. Whatever. All right, uh, I got a Jesse, question for Ramona. Oh, a question, question for Ramona. Okay, this fine. is from Michael Senor Shutter. He says, "Hi Jesse, Senor Shutter here. Question for any of the rad girls." How much did it hurt uh, when you used a car bumper to do bikini waxes? P.S. I donated. Woo! Senor Shadow! Yeah, Senor, we love you. That's so Thank nice. you. Um, okay. How bad did it hurt? Well, pretty much as bad as you can imagine having your pubes ripped out by the root. Pretty much hurt, but I mean, it wasn't any wow. worse than any other Brazilian bikini wax. In fact, it was better. Right, because you were outside. I was distracted. Yes. Yeah, and it was like, it was like team Team waxing. Team waxing. Because Clem drove the car, the, right. the, you know, Munch held my hand so I wouldn't like get pulled over, like off balance. Right. Uh, we actually had a like a like an esthetician clean it up out like two days later. Right. That would like, be weird. Well, I told her what happened and she was like, Is there a forest what? fire? You're like, no, no, no. It's a cavalier. <laughs> Um, it was a good right. job, though. It was a so good job. before we let you go, because we have to get to the other two sure. rag girls, and then we have to get to all three of you at the end. So since we have your double-jointed thumbs, yes. and we also have a ukulele, which would you like to show off? Oh, I'll play a little. I'll play a little, little ukulele? All little right, ditty. so we'll set this one up. This is called Useless Skills. <laughs> and uh, John, give us a little song. Useless skills don't <laughs> pay the bills, but they're fun on camera. Useless skills don't pay the bills. But they're so fun on camera, but they're kind of useless. All right, so we're here with Ramona Cash, uh, Rad Girls, and Rad Girls, by the way, on Mav TV, Mav TV, M A V. M A V T V. Um, you can check it out on uh, Friday nights, and you can check your local listings. What are you going to play for us? Uh, this is a Hawaiian song. I kind of need to cut my nails, as you can see, but All that's right. okay. Uh, it's called um, Kapua. Wait. Kapua. Mm, I'm sorry, I can't think of That's it right, right now, but... You, uh, you could lie, I wouldn't know. Anyway. I know, I can play it though. Aloha bao ia oe ku ui po Ku ule mo mi ku mili mili Hoka heke oe o na pua Ake ku upu na ahe i hi po i ne It's kind of out of tune. Ha ole ka mana o ke i ke aku O ma ka palu palu me ke aloha Elo e pili ia i ke pu'u vai Aina ia ia na kamakua There's another verse, but I think we'll just skip it. Sorry to all the Hawaiian purists out there. Yeah! yeah. Wow, Ramon Cash! Awesome. Dick uh, Nam just said, how is this useful? I and see. I totally this is, agree. This is yeah. Honestly, I felt like this was the end of the most beautiful Don Ho movie ever. All right, Ramona Cash, we're going to cut over to John Thank and Jesse. Uh, she'll be back at the uh, end of the show with uh, Easy, Medium, or Drunk. Uh, big hand for Ramona Cash, everybody. Ramona. Good job. All right. John, Jesse, let's get 30 seconds of I Am names, please. Okay. Faster. Yes. What? <laughs> Ready? Go. Yes. Justin, One Vito, A Carol, Adam, Agamemnon, Aliens, Alpha, Altoid, ALX, Andrew, and Honest Fraud, Alcatraz, Bay, Basketball, Blue Wings, Brady, Broken Sausage, Crust, Siphonate, Diaz, Chris, Church, Coordinable, Console, Gamer, Craig, Hayes, Cubus, Max, Cynical, Optimist, Andrew, CMD, Generation, Digimap, Dick Nam, Drew, Foxy, Elohim, N York, Fatty Lama, Demi, Fatty Bomb, Fatty, Phil, Fan, Fresh, General, Me, Grant, Noel, Hemoglobin, Carrie, K Risk, Killer, Nail Belly, Lilac, M1, 
Magic Milk Oh my god! That's all you've got. Oh my god! All right. Um, uh, we are live on Tuesday night. It is February 23rd. I have all three rag girls with us. They're on Mav TV. You can check your local listings. It's on Friday nights. We have the second of three rag girls. Please give a warm welcome to Darling Clementine, everyone. Darling Clementine. Welcome. Hi. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having Love me. Love your shirt. Thank you. Like the tiger. I wore it last night, too. I can tell. You can tell. Um, so uh, you got arrested for impersonating a waitress. Yes, Please. I did. That um, was that was one of one of the things I've been arrested for. The most awesome <laughs> upside of that is that you get to go back to your job of not being a waitress, which is kind of a slap in the face to the waitresses in the world. Um, which well, I think. you know, I I really had fun roller skating. If I were a waitress, I would be a sonic waitress. So, so I tell could us, roller skate. tell us a story how you got arrested for um, this. Well, actually, we were in Florida, and we weren't sure if sonic waitresses still used roller skates. Right. They do. Come to find out. Um, however, especially you definitely, pregnant. That's a sweet look. Roller well, skating. Well, I wasn't, pregnant. I wasn't pregnant though. That you okay. know. All right. Did I look pregnant? I don't Are know. Are you insinuating? I didn't see the bit. Have you heard something? I have heard something. Oh, okay. Congratulations. Thank you. Anyway, <laughs> um, we uh, were on the premise and didn't have the appropriate waivers signed to, uh, to be roller skating and waitressing. Um, so when people would order their normal Sonic dinner of like uh, chili cheese hot dogs and fries, I would come back with a banana or a house plant, right. a nice house plant or a magazine as opposed to what they actually ordered. So, um, How does that lead to your arrest? First of all, you're bringing like probably more wholesome stuff than yeah, ground up cattle that's right. like full of steroids and whatever they got. Like, God damn, I didn't order this cactus. Well, and I was shooting the duck, you okay. know, showing off my roller skating mm -hmm. skills. Oh, I thought that had something to do with your vagine. I didn't oh, know. Oh, no. Shooting the duck. I thought it had. No, it's the... a roller skate move. It's, you know, it's like you're. Oh, down I get you. you. Okay, like, cool. Shoot the duck. I shoot the duck. Yeah. Okay. So I was, you know, showing off my skills at roller skating. Right. And um, all of a sudden, this sheriff pulls up out of nowhere and. At a um, Sonic. What are the odds? And and asks me what I'm doing, and I told him I was applying for a job. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I had the like application there and everything, and he immediately like goes to look at the application and just lays the cuffs right on me. And, Solid. And like and not only not only did he cuff me, he like cuffed both hands. It was like I was like a true menace to society at that point. He like. He handcuffs me backwards, so I'm roller skating backwards as this police officer is dragging oh me God. away. I'm in a pink dress, a visor, and pink and white roller skates. I mean, it was. Should I not be getting turned on? Because this is like the hottest setup of a porno <laughs> that I've ever heard. And my hair was in Jerry curls too. Wow. Wait. So, what town in Florida? First of all, Tallahassee. This is our problem with Florida. It's serial uh -oh, killers, we're get angry email. rapists, and four wheeling. And what Jeff the hell? Bush. Where were you in Florida? Um, Fort Pierce, Florida. I don't even know. Martin County, Florida. It's actually the um, one of the highest uh, murder areas. No, where you can pick Drug? mushrooms. Drugs, yeah. See, there you go. Florida, what do you got? Nothing. That's what you got. Luckily, they're not Cow literate. shit and mushrooms. That's right. Um, all right, so uh, you have been a, a rag girl. Are you an original rag girl? Is there an original lineup? It's like an ORG, huh? An o original rag Rad girl. girl? Oh, okay. OG, RG. Uh, are you an OG, RG? <laughs> <laughs> Why, yes, sir, I you am. Are. And how did you come up to meet with the uh, the Rag Girls? How did you hook up with it? Craigslist? Um, you know, no, actually, it was like a, a 25th ecstasy-driven uh, birthday limo ride. And that's how you got a job, being a Rag Girl? <clears throat> Pretty much. Sounds about right. Yeah, I was, like, hired after that. All right, I'm here with uh, Clementine. Uh, Clementine? No, it's not like Ovaltine. I'm not a T. It's like an orange Clementine. This is my damn show. I, will, I know, I know. <laughs> I will call you Clementine <laughs> if I want. That's right, right? Good, yeah, thank you, you sorry. Um, all right, we, uh, we're gonna do the 59 second gauntlet with her. We have a few minutes left. And uh, by the way, Rad Girls, if you wanna win the DVD, Rad to the Bone. To the Bone. Rad to the Bone, you can uh, do it by following us on Twitter. LV, our super producer, uh, is twittering out questions for you to win the stuff, all <laughs> of it. you fan to LV, she's always so surprised. <laughs> what, me? Uh, Hello? So if you want to win the autographed sweet merch and Rad Girls, you can check out on Mav TV mm -hmm. on Friday nights. And I checked the whole listings. It's actually on tomorrow at like 9 p.m. and So awesome. it's on a lot. A lot, a yeah. Lot. They, yeah. Like they like a us, lot. They like us at Mav. They love you at Thanks, Mav. Thanks, Mav. 
Um, all right, so questions, hellos, chat room, uh, people, a couple questions right now, and then we're gonna run the gauntlet, get our third rag girl up here, and then we have a game show, Beer Fueled Mayhem. Great. That's not the name of the show. Jesse? Well, Dick Nam says, chill, this chick looks like she could knock me out. She deserved to be arrested, says hemoglobin. And uh, we got a question from Telemundo. Was there any stunts that they have done that couldn't been used on TV? <laughs> By the way, that's actually his actual voice. That's uh, Telemundo. Have there been any stunts? I did see that uh, be used. with bonus skits unfit for TV. Yeah, too fat for TV. Do you guys circumcise a grown man? <laughs> like, what did you do? No, but I will add that to our collection of you ideas. Should. You should. Just go into a super cuts, kick the door in. That's, that's right, Snip. What I can say is we have uh, some unfit uh, for TV features that are that include ice cream, dildos, mm. um, boobs, anything else? Ice cream, yeah, dildo, poop. poop. <laughs> Which is actually the name of our first album, Ice Cream, Dildos, and Poop. Awesome. Which is, uh, just so you know. Well, I'm also the music supervisor. Maybe I could license oh, that for our see? next season. All right, fair enough. All right, um, any great questions, Jesse? Otherwise, I'm going to go right to the gauntlet here with Darlene Clementine. Um, you can go right to the gauntlet. OK, good. All right, here we go. Because, you know, people are like, whatever. All right, um, uh, All right. so John, set up the 59 second gauntlet for Darlene. Please. Oh, that's your first name, right? right. You can call me Clem. 59 second, 59 second, 59 second, gauntlet. 59 second, 59 second, 59 second, gauntlet. Try to answer all the questions. All right, before uh, we run this, no. John, thank you. <laughs> Do it. John. No. I. 50. John. Nine. Okay. Seconds. What? John. That was John Fulton, everybody. In an awkward moment. Um, let me give you your plugs. Raggirls.tv. You also have myspace.com slash scarlet drawl. With That's two T's. Two T's. And one L. And then you also have uh, djivla.com. Because mm -hmm. you book DJs. Yeah. Sweet. Because I'm a DJ. Really? No. <laughs> but my dog's a DJ. I know everyone's a DJ. Like, bro, I got a sweet iPod. I'm like, yeah, that's everyone. Like, let me just plug it in. Play. Mm -hmm. I'm done. Um, all right, 59 second gauntlet. All you have to do is answer your questions directly to that camera. You're the only rag girl who gets to run the gauntlet. Today. Okay, I have a friend I call a gauntlet. Okay, good. This is great. I'm familiar. Um, by the way, most guests don't finish. Mm -hmm. So if you want to finish, just say whatever comes to mind right to that camera. Okay. And I will try and make it as clear as we can. And LV, count me in. Three, two, one. Porn star name. Dixie Blue. Most embarrassing moment in your life. <laughs> um, man, last in, night. <laughs> in high school, I was. A cheerleader. Biggest star you've ever met. Um, mini me. Biggest. Wait, I lied. Sorry, my friends met him. <laughs> biggest jerk in grade school. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> um, biggest jerk. In, in grade school. This is not going well. You gotta go faster. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Song, Pass. song playing while you lost your virginity. Pass. I don't. Know. One thing on your iPod. Um. It's usually quicker than this. I don't know. <laughs> Pass. Probably my own songs. Would you rather date Elvis or Sinatra? Um, Sinatra. Gift of flight or be a billionaire? Flight. Title of your memoirs. Um. From Hillbilly to Hollywood. Place you go to think. Ah, uh, the ocean. Worst guy's name. Hi. Oh, darling, Clementine, run the gauntlet. You were giving it too much uh, genuine thought. I was. Well, the iPod thing, like, you know, honestly, it probably would be my own band because I, I use it to, like, sing. Oh, you're one rehearsal. of those girls. You're like, hey, do you like this band? Do you like it? It's me. <laughs> it's no, me. I'm not. I just I you're feel like I can always improve on my voice, so I have to be singing all the time because I realize that sometimes it sucks live. You can be you can be more positive. All right, uh, raggirls.tv. We have another clip. Uh, this clip. Let's show the mousetrap clip, please, Brian. We're ready to roll. When we come back, we're gonna have the third. Rad Girl Munchie, Rad Girls on Mav TV, Rad Girls TV. Show the clip. Well, oh, is, is John not going to intro this one? No, of course I kind of like that. You know what? Oh, oh, oh now no, no, I didn't intro before. I'm you know? trying to roll right to the damn thing as well, a polished little. But this was a new thing. I liked it. I liked right, John, John the set it up. That yeah, was great. You know what? Brian, I appreciate you stepping in there. <laughs> John, John, man, man. just do it already. I got your back, dude. I got your back. Thanks so much, man. John Fulton Show coming 2011. Rad girls, come in too. What are they gonna do? Rad yeah. girls, all 
them too. If you still. <laughs> well done. Ooh. Dubini, are you ready to play? Yes. Mouse ready. Let's go. Good. Dubini's the OG RG back right, from yeah. 2005. <laughs> Kablooey. Yay. Oh, <laughs> smackaroo. Just some rocks. Okay. All right, let's see what number two's got in store for me. All right, from Rad Girls on Mav TV, please welcome our third Rad Girl, Munchie, everybody. Munchie! Hey! Munchie, Hi. welcome. What's up? How are you? Um, I'm great. I heard you shit talk in the show back there. Yeah? I did. You heard me? That was Munchie, oh my God, everybody. I'm so no, I'm just kidding. Uh, Wait, are we live from the future? This is it. Oh my God, what year is this? I don't even know. <laughs> Honestly? Um, so, Rad Girls, uh, you're one of the original members as well. Is there, has there been a lineup change? Um, you know, there has not, but hmm. I think that we're open to that in the future. I mean, we've done three seasons. We've gotten pretty beat up over the past three seasons. So you'd you like know? to sub in? Yeah, I think it's always cool to have like new talent, like fresh, young meat, you know? Right. Like early 20s, okay. you know? Fresh young yeah, meat. Yeah, we want to like hand select some some newbies for the next season, if there's a new season. Okay, so. good, all right. Yeah. Um, if I didn't know what Rad Girls were at the TV show, how would you explain it to Yeah, me? I would say, you know, it's very, it's commonly referred to as sort of the, the jackass, but with chicks. Okay. It's kind of like, I don't know, I kind of think we're like a comedy troupe. It's sort of like a reality series meets a stunt, like, slash prank show. Mm -hmm. um, we definitely, uh, you know, a lot of our, ma our material is very shocking. Um, we like to upset the uptight. Well, like, what you do know? you think has been the most upsetting slash, like, the, the bit that kind of everyone talked about? The one that everyone has talked about. There's yeah. a few. I think season one had the most like visibility. I think so. A lot of people talk about the waxing. You mm -hmm. know, the car waxing. Um, I ate a pubic hair filled burrito for season one. That was but a big one. Honestly, who um, hasn't? I yeah, mean, we you know, live in LA. If you've we, eaten a burrito, you've eaten yeah. a pubic hair filled yeah. burrito. <laughs> we, uh, you know, we played. Uh, we played a little. That. That's <laughs> we, so true. Is that? What is that in my throat? Oh my god. Yeah, we we played a little game of uh, burrito roulette. We didn't know who was gonna get it, and of oh. course, I got it. But you know, I'm kind of glad that I did get it because I am the one rag girl that can pretty much eat anything. You know? Anything. I've pretty much eaten. I mean, I've I drank my own whiz last season. You know. <gasps> okay. You Fair know, enough. I can I can I can do that kind of stuff. But, okay. Um, yeah, Are you willing then, to put it up to wait, the because test right now? Can let's let's or do it. He okay. Can. All right. You know what? It's it's <laughs> mental. I have a good question. It's uh, both. Okay. We have a quick question for Munchie. And by the way, no, I just asked. For the pubic hair filled burrito. What would be the sour cream? That's all I have to ask. Go ahead, Jesse. Over no, to you. I said uh, she said uh, she's one of the only ones who can do it, and she can pretty much eat anything. I said, is it because she physically can or mentally can? I think it's both. Okay. I don't know. I mean, I, I think it's it's definitely mental. You're kind of like you know. I mean, I, I just look at it and I'm like, I'm going to put this down the effing hatch right now and I can just put Could it down. Could you taste the pubic hair? That's no, a great... You know, the pubes weren't that bad. Like, there was no taste. I and know, plus right? it was like refried beans up in the mix, you know? Yeah. So it was kind of, it just like Nothing, nothing says yeah, delicious like, like pubes <laughs> and refried beans. Those are delightful. All right. Well, yeah. we're going to call you on it here, right. Munchie. So right. uh, we have a bit called I Can Eat Anything because okay. those were your words. Okay. John? I can eat anything. <laughs> Anything you give me, anything you give me, I can eat anything. Nice. <laughs> anything you give me, be careful what you say. All right, um, I have a cricket. Oh, I ate one of those in Thailand. Uh, so this is no, yeah, so, no biggie. Okay, all right. I've also got. Oh, it's alive though. <laughs> okay, the one I ate was. Oh my God, it's okay. alive! You're gonna eat her all alive? Right. I've also got a worm. All right, let's do both. Oh, okay. okay, I've also okay. got a shoe. I don't know. We need more things. Um, I, I have, no, it's funny because I was just at the Mac store today. I was trying, I'm learning how to do iMovie, and how I'm trying to, to edit. How this leads to that, I don't know. I, I was, no, because I, I filmed, I had my friend film me eating like tons of different insects in Thailand last okay. last year. So, but it was fried and dead. So this is alive and well. Okay, so let's let's uh, <laughs> let's see if we can do this. I don't All right. know. I will. Uh, oh my God, are you crazy? This is yeah. If we. It's alive. We have, we have, we have, um, there's a, a cricket in there. 
Let's um, go. Okay. Oh and, my God! Do and the we've worm also first. got a worm in there, and and a lot of s sawdust. But you know what? Sawdust is like nature's pubes. So, yeah. in a wow. way. But if you eat okay. that worm, is it gonna like do something in her body? Yes. Of course. But look, we've all had Taco Bell, so clearly this yes. is nothing. Oh, this, this is... show is making me not want to eat ever again. That's from... okay. You're in okay. LA. You don't want to eat. I ever think. Again. I think. I think I should eat one <laughs> or the other. Let's have. Let's have okay. people. I am and find out which one I should eat. I know which right? one they're Are gonna say. Are you a say. producer on the show? Because yeah. <laughs> that's a great idea. That is a stellar idea, Munchie. Up top. All I right, have to give right. it to you. Okay. okay. Fine. Film fan says worm. Alien says worm. Chris Glass says cricket. Worm, worm, both, then Altoid Cricket, Sergeant Sally Cricket, Cricket. Okay, if you were to say a majority. Wow. Cricket. 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 All right, the cricket. cricket. All right, let's do it. All right. You, Are you going to open you it You escape for me? this one. And now back to Polly Shore wig. All right, worm. <laughs> oh my god, I cannot believe um, this. Yeah, it's hopping he's, around. He's jumping. Well, that's what crickets do. Oh, I want to kill it first. Oh okay. my god. Oh cool? my god. Can I just I, say, I just Pamela did. Anderson's never going to do this show now. Oh, they're, they're they're like out watching. Just make sure you don't block oh, the. Are we gonna get a call from Peta? Okay, we have to no, get this a close is a rescue up. Rescue cricket. Yes, oh my god, it's, it's still it's... alive. <laughs> what do you expect? Okay, okay. Nice job, LV. By the way, this is in the budget. All right, guys. I just want you to know. Yeah. It's just a cricket. Yes, it's just a cricket. People Munchy eat these in from... Asia. And that's this what is... someone said. They said I'm Asian. This is basically my yeah. diet. But, <laughs> We're like but a whole. It's deep fried in, in Asia. All right, here we go. She's, As it we... should be. All right. All right, here we go. You have to go a little slowly. The cameras. Oh, she has to go oh, slow now. Okay. Okay. Here it comes. There we go. This Can is you guys zoom from... in on this? This is Munchie yeah. from Rad Girls eating a cricket. Hello, little cricket. Can I, just, I have you for dinner? I just want you to know, That's enough so for everyone dinner? feels better. That cricket raped another uh, cricket. Oh my so God, look at his hands are like no. This is actually this is actually for the betterment of the world no, right now. No. Oh, oh, now you're tired. Are you gonna chew it? <gasps> oh, she's chewing it. Oh, oh yeah. my God, she's. I cannot believe it's she's alive. chewing it. She did it. Get that girl a drink. Yeah. 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 Holy Munchie crap. Munchie from Rad Girls. Holy <laughs> crap. I mean, honestly, I wouldn't. I, I had a feeling. That you were gonna like make me eat something. I, I did not think it was gonna be something alive. So I gotta give you props for that one. Man. I do what I can. That, LV, that is the first do, time do I've you want a water, by the way? Live. We actually, you've earned the first water no, our but, guest has ever had. But a red stripe. Oh, well, we've actually got some, we've got some generic <laughs> beers coming up in just a little bit. All right, so here's what we're gonna do with Munchie Rag Girls, raggirls.tv, at Munchie Rag Girl. We'll give them all the plugs in a bit. Brian, we're yeah. gonna roll to the third clip and we're gonna get the three girls up on stage set up for the game show that's sweeping the nation called Easy. Easy, medium, or drunk. Brian, give me the thumbs up so I can roll uh, to this final clip. Which one's this, midget? Yes, the midget right. wrestling. So, so you, I'll be cutting to John, of course. Yes, that's right. Okay. Stu. All right, John. All right, good. I'm glad to work it. this out. Let me know. You ready? Rat girls, clip number three. You've waited all your life to see. Rat girls! Hi, back, Rad Girls, in just a second here. John and Jesse, uh, we're gonna throw it to you guys uh, so we can get some people in the chat room because we're setting up the lot of Rad Girls right now. John, Jesse, John, Jesse. Raiden Kira just said, that midget just tossed her. And people were freaking out about the cricket. Uh, DZ Knockout said, he owned her. Ouch. Drink Moxie said, midget rape. And uh, Broken Sausage, dude just laid the smack down. Pirate Zombie Ninja saw part of that on Pit Boss. Cool. Hemoglobin, what does it feel like having a midget wrapped around your leg? I'm pretty sure you can answer that for all of us, Hemoglobin. Okay. <laughs> Sergeant Silence says, I want to be Munchie's wingman. Oh, and we had a question from Chris W. wanting to know if any of the girls were single. Oh, boy. Uh, so I guess we, I'll find out that for you, that Chris W. Second. 
Um, all right, so here's what we're gonna do. We're about to get this set up. We're doing a live game show with the girls. It's called Easy, Medium, or Drunk. And this is the way it works. I'm gonna explain it once now and then explain it when we set up the show with the bit. Uh, I have three easy questions, three medium questions, and three really hard questions. Or not so hard, but they may take a little time. While one rag girl is answering, the other two have to keep drinking and drinking and drinking until she answers correctly, okay? So that's how we do this game, and we have a song for it. John wrote special for you. This bit is called Easy, Medium, or Drunk. John? This game is easy. Medium or drunk <laughs> This game is easy Easy, medium or drunk Oh, this game is easy Easy, medium or drunk That's right, that's right I can't wait to see this game All right, we're on uh, nice Oh, there chair. we go Look at nice the girls chair. already drinking uh, all right, easy, medium, or drunk. By the way, radgirls.tv, their new DVD. You can win it by following us on twitter.com slash live from future. Radgirls have their own Twitter. We'll do all the plugs in a bit. This is how the game works. Uh, Ramona, Clementine, or Clem, and Munchie. This is the order. You're each gonna get an easy question, a medium, and a hard. While your rag girl is answering, from the minute I finish asking the question, you have to be drinking and drinking and drinking. All right, you guys ready to play? Yeah. All right, so the first one up to answer is Ramona. That means okay. Clem and so Munchie no, start drinking at the end of the question. Ramona, yeah. what is the order of the colors in the rainbow? Roy G. Bit, red, orange, yellow, Keep drinking. green, blue, indigo, Violet. There you go. Oh, All right. Right. Oh, How did you know that? All right. You know that. Cool. You're not really she's a teacher. Teacher. Okay. Now, just so I know, because I can see the monitor, Clem. You can't stop drinking until she's done and the question is correct. So if you screw up the question, you guys have to keep drinking. That's all I'm going to say. Pace yourself. So it's all on me. All right, here we go. Clem, you're up next. Okay. All right, remember, this is the easy round. Okay, girls, the minute I finish the question, start drinking okay. Ramona and Munch. What is the most populated country in the world? Tokyo? Uh, keep drinking. That's you can help her out, Jesse. Most populated country <laughs> in the world. Keep drinking. Country, Japan? I'm good. China. China, there you go. All right. Woo! Woo! Very nice. Yeah. That is awesome. Yes. By the way, t uh, Munchie, Tokyo, Mumble, she's not like, a country. A city. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> now I'm really worried for the later rounds. Sorry. I thought these were going to be the. You're on the spot. My attention right. skills are. Yeah. All right, here we go, girls. <laughs> Uh, Munchie, last one for easy round. Spell David Hasselhoff. <laughs> oh, Jesus. The Hoff? Jesus. No, spell the whole name. David Hasselhoff. Girls, okay. start drinking. D-A-V-I-D Hasselhoff. H-A-S-S -S Keep drinking. E-L-H-O-F Oh. F. F. Yeah! All right. I think, miraculously, some of the rat girls are able to drink and give extra Fs over there. All right, um, All right. here we go, round two. This is now the medium questions. God, if those were hard for some of you guys, this is gonna be, this is gonna be death. We know, we heard about it. All right, here we go. Ramona, you're up next. Ramona, name other girls. Start Bottoms drinking. Up, baby. Five <laughs> elements from the periodic table of elements. Mm -hmm. Name five. Copper, helium, calcium. Keep drinking. Sodium. Iron. Yeah, Ramona. Oh, right, it's it's amazing. No fact checking here. We're all like, yeah, that sounds good to me. Iron. Continue. Okay, here we go. Clem, you're up next. <laughs> all right. All right, here we go. I'm a little worried. Clem, what is the smallest state in the United States? Hawaii? Nope. What's the smallest state? East Coast. Oh, Rhode Island. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. I never would have gotten that. All I don't right. even know where Rhode Island is. Hey. Munch, you you're up next. <laughs> Tell me the answer. This, is, this, this question is a little brutal. This could be a hard question, oh. but I'm going to ask Munchie anyway. All right. All right. How many centimeters 
in a meter. Oh man, you're killing me here. Uh, <laughs> oh, that wasn't oh, even the harder thousand? one. I kind of dumbed it down for this one. All right, go ahead. A hundred? Yeah, there you go. All right. <laughs> Woo! Now, I don't know how many beers, have you guys gone through any of these beers yet? I'm, I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Okay, good. Yeah. You may want to crack another one because you guys have to keep drinking the entire time your co-rad girl starts struggling with this. Cracked open. All right, beautiful. Here we go. Okay, this is the last round of Easy, Medium, or Drunk. Ramona, you ready? Yeah! All right, here we yeah. go. Start drinking. Name all seven dwarves. <laughs> keep drinking. That is Munch a funny and question. clap, keep drinking. Okay, I like how mine are lists. Yeah. I'm, I'm a list maker. I'm stalling so that they can, they can drink. Okay. <laughs> Happy, sleepy, dorky, just kidding. Uh, <laughs> sneezy, grumpy, doc, bashful. <laughs> that was fun. That's a reindeer. Oh! <laughs> no, she's right. <laughs> Let her keep going. No, that's right. There's, there's like, one more. Donner and Blitzen. Um, no, there's one more. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, oh, lazy? Is that no. a dwarf? Is there an angry one? Starts with a D. Stoner? No. Um, <laughs> D? Dopey. There you go. <laughs> Two questions left. Two questions left. All right. You know, by the way, BT Dubs, is... everyone, everyone thinks that Clementine is pregnant. She's <laughs> drinking. Oh, God. She's I not. When I was... uh... Awesome. That's my best stunt to date. Yeah. <laughs> she was prego and drinking last weekend mm -hmm. at the Voodoo. That was cool. Yeah, All I right. pregnant in like 20 minutes, and then I abort the child in 20 minutes. <laughs> Now Cheers. that's that's you efficient. Go. Uh, okay, Clem. Yes. This this is this oh. one's well done. Oh, you missed it. Beast out. I had to let him beast out. You all right. Know. All right. Clem. Okay, now. Name all the planets. Well, Pluto does no no Pluto no longer exists. So. What point? Pluto no longer exists. Dang. <laughs> So there's, God, I don't remember. How about just name three? Venus. Name three of the planets. Yeah, name all of them. Saturn, Saturn Venus, Uranus, Earth, um, Uranus. <laughs> um, one more. Mars. Yeah! Jupiter! Yeah. Yeah. All right, last one. Rad Girls, by the way, Mav TV. You can check it out Friday nights, mavtv.com, and radgirls.tv. Munchie, last one. The, everyone has to be drinking on this oh. one. Uh, <laughs> Munch, <laughs> which land did Puff the Magic Dragon live in? Where Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea. Drink. Yeah. Right. You gotta keep drinking. Wait. Um, he lived in a land. It rhymes with sea. <laughs> Honolulu. Yeah! Yay! That's how we do easy, medium, or drunk. How about you give the Rat Girls a big hand, everybody? Rat Girls! Yay! Let's give all their plugs here because we got to wrap it up. Rad Nerds is coming up uh, at, uh, at 10 o'clock. Uh, we have uh, radgirls.tv. Why don't you give your Twitter addresses because I... Uh, it's... Uh, okay. Good. I can do it. Go ahead. Um, we're at uh, twitter.com backslash radgirls backslash that clementine. Nice. Backslash munchy radgirl. Um, also check out backslash a new... Ramona Cash. <laughs> oh, Ramona Cash. Sorry. <laughs> Um, yeah, and make sure to check out a new episode of Rad Girls every Friday night at 9 p.m. on Mav TV. Go to MavTV.com for more information. Um, Dish Network 361. 361. Yeah. And also follow Mav on Twitter. It's backslash, backslash Mav TV. Yeah, uh -oh. and also we have a MySpace. We have a Facebook. Find us. There you go. Oh. How about a big hand for all the Rad Girls, everybody? Rad Girls! We're going to be giving away autograph stuff. They'll hang out in the chat room in the post show. Uh, and uh, and that is our show for tonight. So big, big hand for Clem, for Munchie, and Ramona. Great guests. We have more swag to give away. Jesse and John sounding amazing tonight. Next week, we're back with Bryce and David from AssFest. We also have two weeks from now, Brian Posehn. Lots of crammed, amazing, beautiful guests. Livefromthefuture.com. Follow our Twitter, Live from Future. And that is our show we have a special guest sitting in with Johnny Fulron you know him and love him from the fresh Jack Voorhees everybody Woo! Jack Voorhees mean Peter look at that look at that there he is there you are that's our show we're gonna say good night we'd like to stay forever but it just ain't right 
That's our show. We're gonna say goodnight. The guests were all so rad. Yeah, they sparkled in the light. Do you remember that time when they did the thing with the stuff and they were eating the cricket? That was awesome. <laughs> and when they were drinking, that was cool. <laughs> I like drinking. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh, Brian just got here. Oh god. Come back, Brian! Come back! 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 There he is! More cream! Lick it off of him! Tony, lick your eyeball! Oh my god! Oh my god, that's so. Ew, she's eating it off of him! She's eating it off of him! Next, I'm gonna try to switch! 